so far you had been creating data pipelines by writing programs for it whether it was a hive query or a pick script or even a java map reduce program you had written those pipelines at a very core level now to integrate those pipelines you also made use of a third party library provided by elasticsearch but what if there is a system which can read any type of input source transform that data and then store it on some output systems like data storage systems such as uh, sdfs hive tables or even plain files that's exactly what logstash is it takes the complex programming out of the equation and enables data engineers to create data pipelines in minutes instead of hours or days so logstash is an open source centralized data processing pipeline which can read data from various input sources as you can see on their website it can read data from apache log salesforce uh, beats or any any system even the database okay then on the second level it can filter the data as per the configuration and finally store the filtered data or the final result into some storage systems like uh, sdfs file system or even elasticsearch or it can also save it into plain files okay and we will see how this works in our uh, exercises and it's very easy compared to what we have done so far as far as building data pipelines is concerned okay so let's move on to the next level and install it on our machine and then we will take it from there okay i see you in the next class